What's going on YouTube? Gios right here. Today we're discussing about jailbreak detection bypassing. We have great news for those of you who are interested in that, no matter what jailbreak you're using, because one important tool for that purpose has been open sourced. We're going to get to that in a second. Before that, this video is brought to you by 8K Sec Academy, which provides mobile security courses that you can definitely use to learn how jailbreaking works, to learn how to find vulnerabilities on iOS and Android. So if you want to learn how to build your own own jailbreak one day this is a very great foundation to start on they have over 92 videos in one course so that's definitely great for those of you who want to learn how iOS works how to create exploits and stuff like that the jailbreak detection bypass tool called a bypass is now open sourced according to the original developer anybody can fork it and continue development so here is the repo and it's now available you can go ahead in the code you know make changes whatever but this this is actually a quite interesting thing you use this as essentially on apps that don't allow you to open them because you are jailbroken, which is not even a great move because that can be bypassed and jailbreaks by themselves are not insecure. It's what you do and what you install while being jailbroken that can potentially expose you to security issues. So applications doing this have really no reason to do it other than the fact that they just dislike jailbreaking. So a bypass is one of the tools for now there are many and this one is mostly tailored towards Taurine, Uncover, Odyssey Rain, Uphel Rain maybe and stuff like that but you do have modern ones as well for iOS 16 and whatever and for example we have the root height jailbreak which comes with jailbreak detection bypass this one is essentially dopamine jailbreak a fork of dopamine jailbreak but it includes jailbreak detection bypass I do have an article over here on idevicecentral.com for the rest of the jailbreaks for example for Pell Rain or for Machina A15 whatever you can use current bypass on some versions you can use vnode bypass all the way up to iOS 16 so there are quite a lot of methods to bypass jailbreak detection but this tool is now completely open source and I do hope somebody will get to update it it has been updated last a couple of years ago however there are some changes made yesterday don't know what for or what they do that's all the developer posted the fact that it's now open sourced and they encourage forking and continuation of development so definitely check it out if you have especially an older jailbreak do keep an eye on it maybe somebody forks it and continues development on it it's an important tool, especially nowadays. Thank you for watching. I am Gio Snow. Peace out.